Now that, that breast on that side, that's a huge breast right there. Everybody loves big, big breasts, right? Chicken, chicken breasts, that is. Good afternoon, everybody. Hello. We are here in Burbank, California. Yes. At the one of the original Bob's Big Boy restaurants. Mm -hmm. It's a beautiful sunny day here, and we are at the oldest uh, Bob's Big Boy in America. Op operating, yeah, yeah right? oldest operating Bob's Big Boy in America. Uh, it is around lunchtime. We're gonna go try some of their classics that I know people who have been coming here for years because ever since 1949, 1949 because they're celebrating yeah. their 75th year this year um, that's we're going to try to get some of those classics that yes. hopefully you remember right and you know we had put a community post a while mm -hmm. ago asking what nostalgic place you want to see in the greater la area uh -huh. and bob's big boy came up as number one yeah so we are here yeah let's go check it out here's the menu check it out Everything that they have as a classic is like in in box bars right here. So of course we have to try their famous onion rings. So we got an order of that. Their famous big boy combo, their burger combo. We got that. And on the next page, Pappy Parker fried chicken. Remember that? Uh, I think it was a commercial where the little Peppy Parker thing would be running on top of the uh, on top of the seat, so we had to get the Peppy Parker. The famous chili, we got the we got the Bob's favorite chili spaghetti right here. But they also has a we also have a chili size, but we opted for just the, the chili spaghetti. And for dessert, you know we're gonna have to go for the Bob's famous hot fudge cake. But that's going to come at the end of our meal. So yeah. Oh, for breakfast time, they also have the fried chicken and waffle combination. And let's see what else they're famous for. All right here, Bob's famous ham steak. So those two breakfast items we decided to uh, skip because it is lunchtime. But I think we got enough stuff. So. And they serve breakfast all day. All day, yeah. As we just got our salads and waited for the rest of the food, we're just checking out like the decorations inside here. The, the chandeliers, they look like they're straight out of the 50s and 60s design. On the booth near us, they have the old original Bob's Big Boy menu in a frame. Uh, lots of paintings, pictures on the wall, including the drive-in where they have like a hot rod vehicle. In fact, every, was it Saturday and Sunday nights? I think so, yeah, weekend. Yeah, they have a hop service Car hop. here. Car hop, right. And then on Fridays, they have uh, a car show. Mm -hmm. so classic that, cars. Yeah, so it's a big parking lot over here. They have a big classic car show. Uh, of course, we're not here on those, neither of those days, but the amount of artwork and pictures here is, there's always something to look at. Every single wall has something to look at over here. So now, yeah, we got our salads here. We got a couple ranches and one a thousand island. And you know, because a lot of our meals came with salads. That's the reason why we have three salads here. So yeah, let's try out these salads. Here's my salad with ranch dressing. I mean, ranch dressing with thousand island. Yeah, I, I got the ranch. Yeah. Good. A regular garden everyday salad good lettuce is fresh croutons thousand island dressing it's a good starter to the meal now i'm sure uh, if you request it you can get the dressing on the side yes mm -hmm. since they make it it should be easy to request the dressing on the side if you want it that way bob's famous chili spaghetti has really good thick pieces of garlic toast really nice bed of spaghetti with that chili on top and cheese they give you the spoon to help you roll this up let's go ahead and give it a try it smells delicious you can really smell the seasoning you can smell 
that beefy flavor in it. Let's go ahead and make, get this ultimate bite right here. Now, can, uh, oh. the last time we kind of had chili spaghetti was in what, Cincinnati? Mm -hmm. right? Yeah, Skyline. Right, I remember? Because right. mm -hmm. you don't see chili spaghetti on Not the menu too much at all. Not that often. Alrighty, here we go. Let's roll this up well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that bite right there. Good pieces of chili and cheese. Mm. That's a really good chili. You can taste that beefiness in it. You can taste all those spices. What is nice about this chili, it doesn't have any heat to it. So you can match it up with this garlic bread. This garlic bread is garlicky, delicious. Match it with this spaghetti right here. You can see the great pieces of meat, the cheese. Get this, roll this up. This is a, a good meal. I can see why it's their famous, why they're famous for it. Mm -hmm. Very good. Here we have the original Bob's Big Boy combo. It is a double patty. It kind of reminiscent of like a Big Mac from McDonald's. Uh, world famous onion rings over here. You know what I like about the onion ring is they're all different size, like diameter. So you could tell that they came from like a whole onion. There's some smaller pieces all the way to the middle, back out to the small end again. But well, let's try this out. The onion ring first. Oh wow, very crispy onion ring. I love the crunch in it. Of course, you can tell that these are nicely battered because when you bite it, you know how it is, it bites clean. If it's like frozen, the onion will just kind of pull through. But this is a nice clean onion ring. Great flavor too. It's got maybe a very slightly seasoned batter. It's delicious. But here we go, big boy combo. They cut it in half for us. Otherwise, I think it would just come just whole without cut. And to note, what we saw on the menu is these hamburger patties are never frozen. So they're fresh. Here we go. It's a nice side profile. Got your lettuce, cheese, and the red relish, which is probably like a ketchup relish. But let's go ahead and try it out. Sesame seed bun. This is a great burger. I'm not just saying that. This has that fresh ground beef patty flavor to it. I know a lot of frozen patties, the taste gets lost. So this is definitely a juicy burger. Fresh ingredients, love it. Uh, along with the french fries, they do have some big boy seasoning salt on the table, which I think will like match perfectly on these french fries. Let's try it out. Yeah, pretty good. Not too salty. It just gives that nice, uh, I guess, seasoning. It's almost like seasoning salt. So it's, it's really good. Yes, honey. You guys good? Oh, very good. Thank you. Yeah, so the famous combo cannot be beat. They probably served this since, you know, 1949, and it's still on the menu, so you know that it's delicious. Happy Parker's Fried Chicken. These are humongous. We had it sit just a bit because we know they're, it's going to be just, like, completely steaming hot. They give you four pieces, and they also give you the same amount of pieces if you're doing the waffle. So we got this portion, which gives you a potato and vegetable, or you can get the four pieces with waffle. So we're gonna go ahead and try this out here. Now the uh, potatoes, you have a choice of either mashed or french fries. Or french fries. Mm -hmm. And either corn or mixed vegetables. Correct. Yes. So look at these pieces. I put that breast, which is a humongous breast there. I'm gonna have, let's go try this thigh. No, I'll do the wing. You can see the crunch. Look at this crunch on this wing. You know what's cooked to perfection? Let's try this out. Mm. 
crunchy. This is a really good chicken. It's very lightly battered. The battered isn't heavy at all. The chicken is, it looks a little dry, but it has a lot of moisture in there. Oh yeah. I can totally get down with this chicken. This is delicious. And these pieces, they're humongous. So this is a really good meal. Here is their mashed potatoes with the gravy. Let's go ahead and try this out here. Good mashed potatoes. I think I need a little bit more pepper though. Good, nice and creamy mashed potatoes and of course corn. Mm -hmm. I love corn, nice and sweet. Nothing to really write home about, but these are just really good sides. I'm gonna need a little bit of pepper though for this right here. Let's try that out. Oh yeah, that little bit of pepper just livens it up a bit. It's a good size. You know I'm a thigh guy. So this is their thigh. Is it the biggest thigh? No, it's not the biggest. It's like a like a medium sized thigh. Let's try this out. Yes, you're right. This is very lightly battered fried chicken here. The seasoning on that batter is very, very nice. It's not overly too salty or, or I don't know, other type of fried chicken type of seasoning, but. Not a lot of spices. No, no, not a lot of spices at all. I say just a little bit of saltiness to it. The perfect amount, like I mentioned. But yeah, this is good. Uh, it's cooked well all the way through. And the other pieces they give you is a little little drumstick. And of course that wing that you had. But let me try out the side real quick. A little bit of the potato. Not not bad. Corn. Probably out of a can, but it's fine. Now the the chicken. It'd be probably really nice to put a little bit of gravy. A little bit of gravy on that chicken. To be a pro tip. Yeah. It's almost like a almost like a Jolly Bee move right there, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, it's really nice. I wonder if they give you a side of gravy for your chicken. Yeah. You have to dunk it. But yeah. Fried chicken? Happy Parkers? Good job. Now, just this dessert itself, the description of it is just plain sexy. Listen to this. This is Bob's famous hot fudge cake. Vanilla ice cream between two layers of luscious devil's food cakes smothered with creamy hot fudge and covered with a whipped topping and a cherry. Now, if that isn't sexy, I don't know what is. We're gonna go ahead and try this out. This absolutely looks decadent. Wow, look at that. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need a cup of coffee, but we'll see. Oh, here's the bite. The chocolate fudge isn't a sweet chocolate fudge. It has a little bit more of that like very dark chocolate taste to it. it has that little bit of bitterness, which is perfect for the ice cream and the whipped cream. Yeah, this is a good one. And and not to mention the devil's food cake is warm. This is a good one. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Yeah, you know, honestly, when they first brought it up, I thought maybe that the cake might be a little bit dry, you know, but it is far from that. It is very moist. Gotta love that chocolate fudge syrup on it. Of course, you cannot go along with the vanilla ice cream. It's just like the perfect dessert sundae type of cake. As you can see, it's shareable. It is. But you're not going to want to share it. 
yeah. This is delicious. Again, I can see why this is on one of the favorite block menus as a as a must try. Yeah, very good. We're definitely gonna work on this right now, and um, we'll see you for the recap. That is a wrap from Bob's Big Boy. That was really good. It's a very good diner, huh, baby? Yes, mm -hmm. a very classic Americana diner type of food. Mm -hmm. It's been here forever. Mm -hmm. 75 it's, years. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's supported by the local community. In yes. fact, it's a little after 1230 right now on a Tuesday. And it's packed in there. It is so crowded. People are just waiting for tables. Yeah, I would only imagine when the car hop is up and running over the weekend or even when the classic oh. car show is here on Friday right, nights. Right. Oh, it's going to be, it's just packed here. And it's a very good nostalgic diner. Very nostalgic. All the photos inside, uh, just looking around, lots of things to look at. So I'd, I'd definitely, if you're in LA, I'd probably stop here and just look around huh baby yeah it's mm -hmm. just a little bit north of downtown la in the mm -hmm. city of burbank mm -hmm. but they do have a cool little souvenir they stuff do. that mm -hmm. buys your shirts stickers keychains all that stuff uh yeah very and, cool place and why not come to the original one this is i mean this is the this is their original one yeah so you have to come to this original one. Oh yeah yeah uh do we have any shout outs i do i do uh sarah happy birthday uh david kang happy heavenly birthday yes thank you so much for over the years watching our videos yes and to his family thank yeah, you so we, much we truly appreciate it yes um glenn and cindy thank you so much for watching and harris Happy retirement. Happy retirement, mm -hmm. Harris. Yeah. He's our own Hana yes. in Hawaii. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. I've seen some of the pictures. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's always barbecuing stuff. Yeah, right? he's always barbecuing. Yeah. Where's the invite? Yeah. I don't, I'm, we're still waiting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They invite us over when you got some Calbee on the grill. Yep. Yeah. So thanks everybody for watching our nostalgic eats here in Burbank at Bob's Big Boy. Mm -hmm. Until our next adventure, we'll catch you on the next one. See you later.